Good morning, you YouTube. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Cause it's wonderful out there. A couple of pranksters, Nikki and John, and then little Iris came along with a mini zoo of adorable pets. You bet you get the best of Nikki and John's life. So I feel groggy. Carrie's gotta wake up. Anyways, it is supposed to be the nicest, warmest, hottest, sunniest day of the year so far in Minnesota. So we'll go outside and just take a look around. Yep. Looks like a sunny, warm, beautiful day here in Minnesota. Funny story about this tree. There actually used to be a tree about as tall as that one, except it was a maple tree. It was great for climbing. I had a tree house in it growing up. Um, it was an awesome, awesome tree, but it ended up dying. They did some road work and they replaced the road here. And apparently, sometimes maple trees, when they're close to road construction and stuff like that, they can die. The roots get affected, so that's what happened. But uh, the roots didn't die, the tree actually died. The roots are still very much alive. And this tree has just shot up because it's using the old tree root system, which is kind of exciting. But I just thought I'd talk about that because I used to have a tree house up in the tree that used to be there growing up and it was really, really awesome. I'm in a hurry to get things done. Oh, I'm rushing, rushing and don't know why. Bum, bum, bum. I'm waiting for Nikki to come over. We're gonna hang out for just a little bit. I'm gonna see Iris and Nikki before I go back to my cabin Later today, I'm gonna go on back up there with my dad. Uh, gonna do some fishing. Hopefully, we catch smallmouth, walleye, muskie, largemouth, just a menage à trois of fish up there. But I'm really looking forward to that. And my nephew and niece are having a birthday party at the end of the month. So I got them plush minion buddies. They really, really love the movie Despicable Me and Despicable Me 2. So I figured I would get this for them and my third and my second nephew. There's two nephews and one niece, and it's Sam and Tess's birthday party. So Max isn't having a birthday party because his birthday isn't right now. So I got three stuffed minions so they could each have one, and I think they're gonna love them. I think she's gonna be the hit of the party. Ooh, so Nikki is up and moving, and she is on her way here. Not here. No, oh, stop see, it. Nikki just no. got here, and I'm vlogging away. <laughs> Baby girl. I get to vlog. I get to vlog. I let you vlog you yesterday. Vlog. See? I, nah, you took the camera. Nikki and I are off for the day. She's going to continue vlogging on her camera, and then when we part ways and I head towards my cabin, I will start vlogging again on this camera. So it'll be like a two-day, one-day, two-day, two-day vlog on YouTube, if that makes any sense. But we are going to go send out the headset that we gave away, the Turtle Beach 7XO, and we're sending it to Paige in the UK, and she's the big winner. So thanks for watching, thanks for supporting the channel, Paige. We really, really appreciate it, and you will be getting your headset. Very Alrighty, good. so I am headed north to my cabin. I just got done having dinner with my mom and Nikki and Iris, and it's kind of sad. I really already miss Nikki and Iris so much, and my mom. I miss my family a lot, so living in California has, I don't know, it's been a lot harder on me the last few years than it has been in the beginning. It was really fun, it was really exciting. I was glad to be there. But now I'm just kind of getting more and more homesick. I miss my family a lot. Um, I'm not quite ready to move back to Minnesota. I know Nikki's not quite ready to move back to Minnesota. But it's just like, it's crazy how much you start to miss your family the older you get. So I am kind of bummed out. Nikki and her dad and Iris might actually come up to the cabin in a few days to hang out with me for the weekend, which would be absolutely fantastic. I think it would be really nice to spend some time with Nikki's dad and just be at the cabin, do some fishing, you know, do some guy stuff, and also have Nikki and Iris around. Because like I said, I get, I, it's crazy how much I miss them. I'm like so sad right now. But I do have to get up to my cabin and make fishing videos and spend time with my dad and my stepmom. I, we're gonna go fishing on a couple lakes and a couple rivers. It should be really, really exciting. And I do love to fish. I do love to spend time in Minnesota. I love being at my cabin. It's just like I said, I've just, you know, miss family. I miss Nikki. I miss Iris. 
but I will be very, very happy when we are back home in California in our home with our pets and our whole family and I'm with Nikki and Iris all the time again. Because like I said, being away from them for so long is actually kind of hard and I don't really like it that much. So I'm hanging out with my dad and we're gonna go check out a local barbecue place, I guess, that just opened. It got some ribs down there or something like that and hopefully it's really good because I love barbecue ribs, but it's our first experience at the barbecue restaurant that just opened. This is the barbecue plans. We drove over to it and it's closed. It wasn't too far out of the way or anything, but we're gonna go get uh, like homemade pizzas out of a brick oven, which are delicious. I love pizza, so maybe we'll get barbecue next time. We are at a different restaurant because we went to four other restaurants and they were all closed, so we're gonna Got a couple specials here, walleye prime rib, chopped salfredo salad, burgers, all sorts of good stuff. But they got pretty good burgers here, so I think I might get one of those. And then in a little bit, I'll be headed over to my friend Derek's house, and I think we're going to go golfing uh, tonight for, you know, an hour or two. They got a Twilight rate where you pay 25 bucks, I think, and you play as many holes as you can. So it should be a lot of fun. So the food showed up. I've got a bacon, lettuce, tomato, avocado sandwich. I think my dad's having a burger. Buffalo chicken. Buffalo chicken. Looks delicious. Okay, so I just got to the driving range. Got my bucket of balls, my clubs. Guess what? Got the blues to myself. But I will. Oh, we're gonna go down there. That's the mode one that has the settings. Let's see if I can record myself hitting some balls here. There we go. That's the bunny shot right there. Get in the hole. I remember that was like 10 yards past. Looks good though. Do the little dance, play a little golf. Yeah, yeah. That was a good one. That was not so good. Time to let the big dog eat. Gotta get my weight forward, but that was a pretty good shot. Well, I just got done hitting my balls. I'm gonna return the bucket. I used to work at this golf course, so I kind of really like it, but. Uh, my friend's working behind the counter, so I'm going to bring this back for him. You can't really see the cloud in the sky right there, but it looks so awesome. Just a light blue black drop with a huge cumulus nimbus cloud. I think that is, I'm not quite sure, but it looks like a big thunderhead or something. Uh, there's a better shot. That looks awesome. Well, I made it to the cabin, and I am just going to hook up the battery charger here. Which I need to find. I think my sister or my brother-in-law probably moved it. But it looks like it's over here. I'm going to hook up the battery, charge the battery. He probably went out fishing, actually, is what he did. Here it is. We just plug this bad boy in, make sure everything is golden here, and we'll be ready to go at 5 a.m. It is late. It took me a while to get up here. I'm really, really glad to be here. We're hooking up the battery. Red is positive. Black is negative. And then we just plug in the battery charger and we are good to go. So I'm just unpacking some of my stuff here. Gonna plug in all my cameras, make sure everything is charged, ready to go tomorrow. But I've also got this water wolf camera, which is really, really cool. And you tie it onto your fishing line, and I was talking about it earlier, but you can actually record the fish strike on the lure, and I think it's gonna be awesome. So I'm gonna take this out, charge it, we're gonna try it out tomorrow. I'm really, really looking forward to it. I'm at the cabin, it's late. I'm tired, I'm going to go turn in and go to bed. I guess Nikki and I kind of dual vlogged today, but I had a lot of fun. I'm really happy to be at the cabin. I miss Nikki and Iris so much. Hopefully, it'll come up here in a couple days or something like that. I'm hoping, keeping my fingers crossed, but we'll see what happens. And uh, I don't know. All in all, it's been a fantastic day. Thanks for watching, guys. I really, really appreciate the support. Tell your friends about us. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you are not already. And we'll see you next time with more vlogs.